Hi church, Narissa here. Today I'm continuing in the thread, the names of God, and I have the name Jehovah Jireh, which means the Lord will provide. And this name came to be about in the book of Genesis, um, a story of Abraham having to sacrifice his son Isaac as a burnt offering. And right up to the moment of Abraham sacrificing his son, the Lord stopped him and said, do not touch the boy. Take this lamb in place of your son. Save your son, don't touch him. Um, and I just wanted to recognize that this was a last minute provide, but to be very clear that he still provided and it was his son. Um, that's huge. And I just wanted to just speak on behalf of like just the father and his characteristics. I know we've been in the message series. Let me introduce you just talking about the father and who he is and his characteristics. And um, I just, I wanted to speak on him providing in our spiritual needs and our emotional needs um tangibly he provides tangibly that's those are what blessings are he he gives more than we could ask for he gives our wants he gives our our needs he meets us in those places um and something that i've been really encouraged about even in the message series is just talking about god doesn't just have these characteristics he literally is peace he literally is love um sometimes we're asking the father to provide us peace but he is peace um and and there's something beautiful about stepping into his presence and just being overwhelmed by peace because we're sitting with him the holy spirit is the only thing that can change things um and so i think when it comes to just asking him to provide a peace asking him to provide and, and give us patience or provide a kind of love that we can't get anywhere else um he does and he will and um even when it comes to last minute needs of financial he does um and i just i wanted to say really quick that he is not a god that limits himself to our expectation meaning whatever we're expecting him to provide for us sometimes it doesn't look like that because he has our best in his mind which means what he provides is better he knows what we need more than we know what we need um and so i just wanted to reference psalms uh, 147 5 really quick i ended up finding this verse and um just was able to kind of understand a little bit better about how much he understands um it says how great is our lord his power is absolute his understanding is beyond comprehension he understands your needs. Um, but I, I have to believe that even in his understanding, there's also a giving that um, he just so freely gives to us um, in the time of needing it. And I just wanted to challenge you guys to um, step out of your timing and step into his. Um, again, he might not give it when we need it, but he'll give it when he knows that we need it, when it's best for us. Um, there's There's a trust factor that comes with understanding that he is Jehovah Jireh, understanding that he is the provider. Um, that's what faith is. We see by faith and not by sight. The things in front of us could look so damaged. It can look so hopeless, um, but he is the hope. He is the provider. He is the peace. He's, if you're needing to just be restored, find freedom, he is that. And so I just wanted to encourage you, church, to um, step into the presence of the one who is all of these things that I've mentioned um, or even talk, that we're talking about in our message series right now. Um, you're not going to find all these things outside of him because he is all of these things. Um, and so I, I'm just I'm praying that um, if you're watching this and you're someone who is in need of something, um, sometimes he's just in need of your heart sometimes that's where he wants to find you first is is give me your heart and i'll give you the rest i'll provide you the rest um and so church i'm, I'm praying for you i'm praying that the lord will meet you at the best time which he knows he knows all the little details about who we are what we are how we are even our thought processes how we respond to things he knows it all um from a to z he knows it all 
Um, so I'm just praying that that you you trust, that you have faith, that whatever season you're in, whatever you're needing, even whatever you're wanting, spiritually, mentally, emotionally, uh, emotionally, like physically, um, he's 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 gonna provide it. I know he will. That's that's who he is. Um, and so church, I hope you're encouraged and I hope you have a great rest of your week.